Hi, I'm Gavin Scott. I'm a sculptor and a screenwriter, and I want to tell you about a novel that I've written called The Adventures of Toby Way. It's the sort of book that I love to read myself because it is a rollicking good yarn. It's set in pre-Victorian England. It's about the adventures of a young man who, at the beginning of the novel, loses everything. And then, as his adventures go on, he meets extraordinary people like Charles Dickens and George and Robert Stevenson, who invented the steam train, and he gradually recovers his fortunes and finds himself in a complete new place. Um, let me read you, if I may, a few paragraphs on the beginning of the book to give you the flavour of it. This is from, from chapter one. If anyone had glanced out of one of the grimy windows of the tumble-down shops and doss houses on the eastern approaches to London in the early hours of April 10th, 1824, they would have seen a man on a horse with a boy in front of him on the saddle they might have thought that the boy was glancing round curiously and guessed that his father was bringing him to visit one of the great markets at Billingsgate or Smithfield, but they would have been badly mistaken. The boy, whose name was Toby Way, was not looking around him because he was curious, but because he was desperate. And the man behind him was not his father, but Dogface Jack Shepherd, one of Britain's most notorious criminals. That's how the book begins. So, if you'd like to join Toby Way on his adventures, Click on the link to Amazon.com below and see if you enjoy what happens to Toby Way.